show you how to create a basic loop in Hammer using logic relays. Pretty simple, pretty easy. Easiest way I found. So we're gonna start with some creating some fires. So first one, A and B fire, we'll name you fire one. Have you take two seconds. Start with one second. Let's go and copy and paste you there. Fire two. Fire two. Fire three. And fire four. So we have all of those. Now we're going to create the logic relays. First one we will call you start fire. We're going to create a second logic relay. Just put it right next to it. Call this one loop. So in the first logic relay in the outputs tab, you're going to add the output. So on trigger, fire one, start fire. So we'll make the group of fires here so we can have them all go in the order that they're supposed to. Fire two, two seconds later. Fire three, four seconds later. And fire four, six seconds later. And at the end of all of that, we need to add one more output on trigger. Um, loop, trigger. Eight seconds later. There we go. Now in the second logic relay, the one we named the loop, we're going to add an output on trigger. Target entity start fire, trigger. So that as soon as first one is finished, once it goes through all of its outputs and tells this one to turn on, this one will tell the other one to turn back on. So it's just going to continuously loop back and forth. So we're going to start this with a button, so we'll make some buttons here. Funk button. Do not need a name for this for the testing purposes, so we have there uh, that looks that's all fine. Outputs on pressed, target start fire, and uh, trigger. So that turns it on. That will enable the process to turn it all on. Then we make a second button to stop it. Or you would make like a trigger or whatever the situation is on your map. So on press start fire, uh, cancel pending. That will stop the process wherever it is, so it does not uh, loop anymore, it does not continue at all. So we're going to save this, I'm going to compile this, and bring it into Gary's mod. Here we are. So we'll go ahead and start this up with our button, turns it on. First fire, second fire, third fire, fourth fire, and then it loops again. And it just goes in one big circle over and over and over and does not stop until we hit cancel. And it stops. Turn it on. Stop it right there. And there's that. That is how you make a loop and hammer using logic relays.